How are you doing, all right? <laughs> Cheers. Um, I've had a couple. I'm not going to lie to you. Now listen up. Um, I hope I haven't offended anyone. I didn't mean, it's not my fault. There's a lot of powerful people here, so if I said, it's... <laughs> Honestly, I like a drink as much as the next man. <laughs> Unless the next man is Mel Gibson. No tough guys, do you know what I mean? No Russell Crowe, he wouldn't be seen dead here, it's TV. It's... <laughs> or Christian Bale, same, no. Keith has got a couple more hours before it gets really messy as well, so. <laughs> Mel Gibson, come on. No, come on. I'm not gonna have a go at him. He's been through a lot. <laughs> not as much as the Jews. First presenter is beautiful, talented, and Jewish, apparently. <laughs> Mal Gibson told me that. He's obsessed. Um, <laughs> please welcome Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> and I mustn't mention Mal Gibson this year. Uh, <laughs> not his private life, his politics, his recent films. Right. A few years ago, on this show, I made a joke about Mal Gibson getting a bit drunk and saying a few unsavoury things. We've all done it. I wasn't judging him, but now I find myself in the awkward position of having to introduce him again. <laughs> Listen, I'm sure it's embarrassing for both of us, OK? And I blame NBC for this terrible situation. Mal blames... We know who Mal blames. Listen, I still feel a bit bad for it, right? Mel's forgotten all about it, apparently. That's what drinking does. No. <laughs> I want to say something nice about Mel before he comes out. Um, so... Oh, yeah, OK, here you go. I'd rather have a drink with him in his hotel room tonight than with Bill Cosby. <laughs> Please Malcolm, Mel Gibson. Yeah. I love seeing Ricky once every three years because it reminds me to get a colonoscopy. Uh. Yeah. Well, if you'd left your drink here, you don't need to leave your drink here. I'll put you to sleep another way, son of a bitch. <laughs> Listen. Yes. Can I ask you a question? Go ahead. I think we all want the answer to this. Mm -hmm. I don't know, ask the guy that said it, it wasn't me. <laughs> uh, thanks, Ricky, for your input.